You want to have things? Yeah. Kiss Gandalf, the gray. I love it. And here's mommy. She just <laughs> she's taking my lap for me. <laughs> you babies. Alright, so let's take a look and see what you are. Hold on one second. Let's see. This is the little boy. Okay. Watch out, Mama. Sorry, Mama's tugging in the way. Hi, buddy. Hi. Oh, and here is, um, oh, I knew that. Okay, that one is the boy and this one is the baby girl. This one would be um, Macy, right? You want to do it? Yes, 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 yes. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. <laughs> and here's currently Macbeth. Oh, baby. Are you my baby boy? Oh, yes. I just woke them up. And then that one over there is uh, Misty. Hi. Hi, baby. Hi. And then here is... Um, Get his name. He's little boy in the middle of the pages. I need to really and truly bring one. And here's one that's not going on the scratching post. Let's put you over there. There you go, buddy. Get your nails all up in there. We got some over here eating my hair. Oh, and this one, I believe this one is the baby girl. Here's the black silver baby girl. Hi, buddy. I really need to remember your name. He's so cute. I know, look at the little head bug. That's so cute. Oh, he wants mommy's lovings. I love it. Look at that. Now he's looking for some snacks. Hi. <laughs> this one just loves the lovings, huh? Do you just love the loving? So what I typically do, right, is with these guys, I typically put them on my lap like this and I just massage their little shoulders and it literally makes them melt and they like right here on their little heads to be loved. Oh yeah. And this, and then if I didn't have the cell phone in my hand, I'd be able to just give them some kisses right up in this little itty bitty cuteness. But I can't put his head down because I know this one down here is playing with my knee. I don't want him to get his little face scratched. Oh, my babies. There we go. Oh, look at that. Look at my little love. And this is Macy. And she is going down. Woo! <laughs> she going down, huh? And we've got, this is Gandalf back here. I'll do the exact same thing if I can get him over here. Oh, there we go. I just literally, I just grab him up. Like this. And I, and this hand's a little bit different, only because I've got that thing on my finger. But as you can tell, if you literally just rub and scratch their shoulders, they just melt. They do. And I try to do this when they're little. And in this way, I can go ahead and while this hand's doing it, I get little fingernail clippers and either have my daughter do the, the little head lovings. And then I just grab their cute little paws and I clip their fingernails so that way we don't have little claws on them huh buddy boy isn't he so cute aren't you so cute Gandalf I love the name it's so cute it's totally you buddy it's totally you look at him oh I love it oh yeah he just loves his lovings mommy's loving up on my back shoulder too it's so cute but all of them would do this so all my little babies oh 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 now, I don't encourage playing with the hands. No, no. And this is one of the reasons why we typically allow kittens to go home past 12 weeks. Because when they play hard with hands and they're little baby kittens, we don't think anything of it. But when they get a lot bigger and they want to play with your little hands and they're like little baby tigers, you're going to be thinking differently. So I normally, if they're wanting to play with the hands, I'll just go ahead and move them with the siblings. Or I'll high pitch me out back like a sibling. And that's ideally when a kitten is young, the reason why they need to stay with mommy. One, as you can tell, mommy is very, very vocal. And so she loves her babies. And if we happen to separate the babies before 12 weeks old, we have mommy crying around trying to find the babies. 
but we've also got little kittens that were separated from mommy a bit too young, and they really need this sibling time because this is where they learn how to play with each other as well as humans. Because when they play with each other and they go too hard, sometimes they'll growl at each other and sometimes they'll just go ahead and meow. And when they meow at each other, it kind of lets them know, hey, that hurts, you're going too hard, and they back off a little bit. So it definitely is a, a good reason why we, we actually wait as ethical, good, reputable breeders on waiting until they're a lot older, you know, 12 weeks plus, before we let them go. The only time I would hang on to a kitten myself past the 12 week mark is if for some reason, um, you know, mommy's still talking to them a lot and they're still playing quite a bit and they're just, you know, if they aren't really ready to be separated from everybody, then there's no sense in, you know, doing that just yet because it's not going to be beneficial to my forever home nor us as breeders because we're going to have this mama just going around calling for her babies and we don't want that either. Hey buddy, you moved the dish and you, you're doing the wrong thing. So what I normally do whenever my babies do this so I come over here and I just pick them up and move them directly in the cat scratcher. And this is the little baby blankies. It's okay, buddy. What, mama? Hi, baby. And there's Misty. I got someone attacking my shoelaces. And just go ahead and hide the shoelaces really quick here. Oh, and I'm sitting on the cat toy. I apologize. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's a little bit hard to do this all by yourself. Hi, baby. Isn't he so cute? And this is Macbeth. Oh, heavens, buddies. Heavens, buddies. Let's move this over here. There you go. And I actually have that, that thing, um, command strip down. Because if not, they'll move it. And this is a little female, um, black and silver. And... Let's see, okay, here's another one. I think this is the one I actually just had on my lap. And I'll do the exact same thing with him. He is hypo, but as you can tell, soon as you just start massaging those shoulders and they just love it. And I don't, I don't play with them like this. If they start getting hypo, I just move them off or give them a toy so they know not to play with my hands. You get a little piece of cardboard on you. And then I got one hiding. Mama. Hi, buddy. And toy, and toy, there you go. Aren't they just lovings? I just love kittens and cats in general. Oh, mama. No, no. I need to get in here and clip your, your fingernails. And I typically clip kittens fingernails about twice a week, um, always needed. Sometimes it may not be. Um, I have noticed with Heavy Metal and Honey Melody, which Heavy Metal is their, their dad, Honey Melody is their aunt. Um, these two fingers on them seem to grow the fastest. And it looks like so far from what I'm seeing on the baby kittens, they kind of have that as well. And it just means that I normally, I normally keep fingernail clippers typically on my pocket, but I'm in yoga pants. So I don't actually have pockets in this. So I don't have them on me at the moment, but when my daughter gets home, I'll typically go ahead and um, clip them. Huh. Hi, I know who you are. You are male, and your name's Gandalf. And this is Misty. Hi, baby girl. Hi, wanna see the camera? Let's go get her some lovin's. I can't remember your name, but he's the, the boy in the middle. And I apologize, they have really untied my shoes now. Yeah, I'm talking to my shoe nurses. <laughs> All right. Okay, sorry. Okay, come here, baby girl. So this is this is Misty. I want to make sure her tail's not underneath her. Hi, Misty. And I just literally massage the shoulder. Ouch. I think she was more interested in eating. And getting loving at the moment. And these guys are just like, we want shoelaces. All right. So, anyway, I just wanted to make a video, show everybody, because all of the kittens have been resolved. They all have forever homes, and they will be leaving me sometime this month. 
but I just wanted to get a little cute video and also address a lot of the concerns um, some of the other Facebook groups as well as uh, people have been asking about why we hold on to the kitten so long. Um, I just wanted to address some of those concerns and um, show you guys some cute little playing kitties. Which these guys are really, really hype at the moment. They need their lunch and then they can calm down a little bit. Hey now, you guys play nicely. But anyways, till next time, thank you so much for watching.